not so daily take you back with another video today i have a fish tank a seven dollar fish tank i'm gonna be unboxing it and revealing it because i saw this in walmart and thought a fish tank for seven dollars that's odd it looks like it'll be pretty small and it has like filters and backgrounds and stuff and rocks so let's go ahead and open it up okay so when you open it just like that i think this is the top plastic piece have a bag with nothing in it very good for the earth a plastic cup that said oh okay so once a week fill the cup with fresh water add water conditioner slowly pour into aquarium wait five minutes then empty reservoir okay so pulling this out oh it's like rimless that's pretty cool I think this is the bottom and some directions we don't need these we're directionless okay so for the bottom we're just gonna put that on like that the back just goes on like this I think it's quite interesting an aquarium for seven dollars at Walmart I don't know what it's gonna be like and stuff so it looks like on the bottom waste goes up and then the airflow brings it up and it filters it out and water falls it back over which is pretty cool so and now put that on and voila so that's what it looks like for the most part but there's some rocks in it so i'm going to go ahead and put those out i don't think I recommend to anyone getting a tank like this to keep a beta in because betas need a lot more room than this. A lot of people think that fish can just go in really small places, especially betas and goldfish, but that's definitely not the case. First, let's go ahead and rinse off the rocks. Got the rocks here. Just going to do a simple rinse, get all the bad stuff out because you always should rinse rocks before you put them in an aquarium because it's bad for the fish for them not to be rinsed. And that should be... We have the stuff right here. The rocks. That's a good bit of rocks, I have to say. A lot of places don't usually give you that many. Let's spread that out. Wow, they're like real and I think that looks pretty good so far. Let's go ahead and put the top on. That goes like that. And now I think the next thing we need to do is go ahead and fill it with water. So it gives you this cup and it's just for filling up and putting the water in. Pretty much how this aquarium works is there is a hole at the bottom of there, a bunch of them, and it sucks them up through that tube and it puts it in there so all the dirty water goes right in there and you just empty it out when it gets full and the beta just goes right in there and lives not so happily because this tank is definitely not big enough to keep a beta in. But for $7, you could maybe decide to get it for some ghost shrimp. Or I think it would be a very good tank if you need a emergency tank. If something happens in your tank, I think it would be a great tank to have just in case you need it for any emergency just to have a backup tank. On other notes during this video, I've had my new beta. Perry the platypus. Perry is what I'm going to name him. He has been acclimating and now time to get him into the water. Okay, time to get Perry into the new water. 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 I also have a blue shrimp in here. It's pretty cool. Okay. Now that he's been acclimated. Now it's time to just take that top off. Just like that. Grab the net. Come on, bud. I'm not gonna kill you. I'm gonna make your life way easier. Voila. 
There he goes. Oh, come on. Get in. Go down. Other way. There we go. Acts just like a platypus. Now we have the blue shrimp right here. Let's try to get a close up. Two guppies. And the ghost shrimp, which are somewhere in there. Don't worry, he's not dead. He's just getting comfortable with the new water. This little hamster, he's happy. Somewhere in there. And we have the tiger Oscar tank. Right there with the nice two fishies and tartar sauce for Plato. Thanks for watching the YouTube video. If you want to see more like this, just comment down below and tell me fishies are all happy back there and everything's good. But that tank right there, nothing in it at the moment, just using it as a backup tank. And well, until next time, peace! <laughs>